Hello everyone, welcome to AI Anytime channel. In this video, we are going to look at Gumloop. Gumloop is an AI automation platform that helps you build AI applications without writing any code. So, for example, if you want to automate some processes or if you have a process workflow automation use case and you want to use a platform, and that's where you can use Gumloop. Gumloop is not the only platform that helps you build no code powered AI applications or nowadays Gen AI applications powered by AI agents, LLMs, RAG, and whatnot. You can also use DeFi AI. So, DeFi AI is also an uh, innovation platform for building Gen AI applications. Then we have Flowwise, which is also a low code, no code platform to build you AI applications faster. So you have Gumloop, you have DeFi, you have Flowwise, and you have multiple others as well. In this video, we are going to look at Gumloop and we'll see how it can help me to post the uh, post, uh, uh, probably a post on LinkedIn uh, from my YouTube video. So we're going to have like, I keep releasing videos weekly and I want to post about it on LinkedIn. How can I use Gumloop and automate this entire process by just you know have a button of just have a button to click and then it will automatically post it then you can also uh, make this as a clone job or a scheduler that will run it uh, on weekly basis so let's have a look at this now you can look at here i am on gum loop already i already have a video on gum loop i can you know give that link in description now this is how the flow looks like currently you can see i have called it linkedin post automation where i am taking video from youtube and then I'm getting a summary of that transcript. So first one is get YouTube transcript and then this summarizer. And then I have something called ask AI and then I have LinkedIn post writer. So these are the components that you can see. Now I have taken a video. You can see here I've taken some videos from here. You know, I've taken this Gemini Nano video that I recently published. And now I want to run this. So if you look at here on the first flow, okay, I'm passing a YouTube video. And then it summarizes that trans like take the transcript and summarizes that further. And then I have an ask AI where I have some prompt instructions that takes this context, which is your summary, and then it basically gives me you know the LinkedIn post and it automatically publishes it. So I have set that credentials. I will show you. And let's run this now. You can see it says flow is started, and in the right hand side, you will see get YouTube transcript, summarizer, ask AI, and LinkedIn post writer. All of these have been automatically done for you, and these are all cached because I'm doing it for the second time, and that's why it's faster. Now, when you open this LinkedIn, you will see that on my LinkedIn, you know, it, it publishes a post called Exciting News from Google Introducing Gemini Nano. The latest innovation that promises quick responses on devices with or without a data network. This efficient model is perfect for on device tasks like image understanding, speech transcription, and text summarization. Coming soon to Pixel and Android devices, blah blah blah. To get a sneak peek, don't miss out on this cutting edge technology. Join the AI Anytime Discord community for more info and giveaways. Let's embrace the future together. So, you know, and we can make some changes and I'll show you once we will make these changes. But this is how you can publish it. And it has published on my LinkedIn account because you do not have to do anything. It automatically, you know, just configured everything for you. Let me just delete this post for now. And now I will just go back and I will show you this how to do this, you know, from scratch. So let's let's do that here. So I'll just copy this because that will be helpful. And I'm going to delete all of this. So let me just delete that, delete, delete. And this is a beginner friendly guys, you know. So this is how it looks like when you commit for the first time. You have just you just have to open internet and just write gum loop and gum loop and AI automation framework platform. Now commit over here and then you will see your for the first time. If you are doing it, you will not see anything. Then you have to basically click on new automation. I already have done that. Now, this is how it looks like when you do it from scratch. We're going to add node. When you click on this node, see this as a workflow, guys, where you keep adding nodes, whatever you need it. So, for example, if I say in my use case is YouTube, get YouTube transcript. So, you can see I'm taking YouTube transcript. But in your task, it can be like scrap a web website or a web page or get 
hacker news so you have get hacker news as well not get hacker i think it's y hacker so scrape hacker news by yc you can see it's a you know if you want to scrape all the hacker news by given a query like llm rag and you want to build a twitter automation bot so for you it will automatically tweet it if you want to do that you can also do it so it depends on you can search all these notes here if you have a file reader you want to read any file for example you want to read a file here let me just show you and this is how you can read so i have this couple of files already there in gum loop so you can get that for example if i select this file and i'm going to build a rag system and you can also give url so that first will be disabled and you can give some web url but i'm not going to do that here let's focus on our use case so our use case is to take a youtube video get the transcription get the summary use uh, ai to basically make it a post and then you post that on linkedin okay now let me do this so this is done the next thing is you need summary just use summarizer and when you have summary you have to link this you can see this part to this one so basically it becomes a flow so you have first youtube transcript and then you have summarizer so this summarize now click on extra settings now when you click on extra setting it says which model you want to use so for example if you want to use cloud 3 haiku you can also use that i'll just keep gpt 3.5 turbo for now okay it depends on you guys how do you want to do cache response means you know if you are asking the same thing and again and again so you do not have to go and hit the uh, api it will just get it from cache memory and that's how it works so let me just do that now once you have summary we're going to have uh, uh let me just show it till now okay so for example if you just want to take a youtube video which video you want me to take i'll, I'll take this gemini nano and i'm going to click on share copy and paste here so let me just paste and once i paste it and i'll just can do run so even on these two flow and i only have one flow here but what it does it basically takes your video transcription and then summarize you can see the summarize thing google has introduced a new innovation called gemini nano blah 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 it is said to be most effective model efficient model excuse me so this is how you get the summary you can see it over here now this is one flow so you can also do that now the next thing is we just only don't want the summary we want ai to basically make it a more personalized for me so i'm just gonna do ask ai that gumloop provide so i'll just make this a bit up so you can see it and i'll just make it here it's fine now it has few things it has prompt is it context you also can pass function so i'll just skip function for now here okay and i'll just paste okay i'll, I'll write it uh, read the youtube video transcript carefully and generate a linkedin linkedin post make it a bit no not funny make it professional you can use a few emojis but do not make it but do not write more than 300 words and last you can you can add a statement saying the post is generated automatically using gum loop automation framework by ai anytime so this is my prompt and you can make it a more uh, a bit more uh, instruction based if you want to give better instructions now we have this summary this summary will go and connect to this context now this summary becomes your context so lm will see that as a context as an information and then use this prompt to basically come up with a a linkedin post now once you have done this the next is to basically get your 
the next is to basically let me just make this a bit more structured yeah the next is we're gonna have a linkedin connector you can also do it on twitter for twitter you need a premium account i do not have premium for now so i'll just use this the free one and then once you have it we have to connect this here excuse me and i'll just connect this here so this is how I look it now linkedin i already have my uh credentials uh, uh, like defined here guys that this is how you do it you have to click on these three bars that you see the hamburger menu or the menu and you have to go on credentials when you go on credentials it will show you everything that you have authenticated with you can see i have authenticated with my google drive google seats i have authenticated with my you know linkedin and then in premium you have twitter as well read write nowadays x and stuff now this is how you do credentials for the first time it will automatically do it for you when you just it will ask you to open a browser and log in but this is how you this is a very simple flow guys you know the idea here my use case is to take a transcript and make it a post on linkedin and i think we are good now let me show extra settings for summarizer so summarizer is also fine you can see gpt 3.5 turbo the same goes extra setting for this i'll also select gpt 3.5 turbo cache response cache response this is fine and now let's you now let's run this flow so once you are satisfied you can just run this flow so let me just do that you can see it says flow is started you know basically it extract whatever you have asked ai is a new prompt so it's not looking at the cache it has to change it and you can see it has posted it now if you look at here it says uh to the post is generated automatically using gum loop automation framework by ai anytime this is this is what i wanted now i'll just make some changes here you can also bring up next latest news and add it there guys i think you can also add that a flow so let me just uh, you know put it here something you know quickly so i'm gonna say ai anytime and i'll just add gum loop here and i'll add for example watch the video to learn how to automate processes using ai and i'm just going to give my link here okay, and as simple as that here and i think you can also get that done through the gum loop or everything but you can see it it's really saved me a lot of time to be honest now this is what it is and i think we are good now this is how you can post it you have your post and stuff and this is what i wanted to show so how easy because not everybody is technical guys not everybody can you know build applications from scratch and not everybody can do that and that's why these kind of platforms are easy for you if you have a freelancing gigs if somebody comes up with a task like invoice processing or you know you know build uh, generating some insights from bunch of google drive documents how you can use gumloop to basically take that gig and freelancing opportunity you know convert that into a valuable partnership with them and you can build applications you can also build it you know you can also do a lot of things here by the way now the same happens with defi if you want to do it you know probably you can also go through defi ai i have a video on defi i have a, I have a couple of videos on gumloop now i have a video on flowwise as well so you can explore all these platforms and yeah that's what i wanted to do in this video guys if you have any question thoughts or feedbacks please let me know in the comment box you can also join our discord community let me show that pretty quick so you just go to discord i'll give the link in description you call ai anytime away on the discord as well already near to 400 people you know and we have global chat where we discuss about a lot of things you know like generic things on technology and then we have events announced we are we are giving some giveaways nitro challenge and some limited edition merchandise to our community pillars that's on the sunday next coming week we have sponsors chat we have job updates where we talk about job updates whatever job is available you know we talk about development updates we have partners we have you know stakeholders if you are a leader cxo you know you can just now like use this we have partners chat as i said we have verified if you are a verified community pillar you can get freelancing gigs on this community you know you can make money out of here you can learn you can do a lot of things and then we have leaderboard you can see people are leading here you know all of these guys are leading you know, and then they get all these benefits 
then we have meme channel because without meme we don't believe you know technology is like we have to be meme based and then we have hackathons we have a lot of hackathons announced we can participate in these hackathons and you know uh, create a recognition for you we have help channel data science gen ai development and blah 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 a lot of things guys here and we keep doing town halls and stuff so join our community it's a growing community and we are thankful for all of your support and looking forward uh, to you know have you here now that's all for this video guys if you like the content please hit the like icon if you haven't subscribed the channel yet please do subscribe the channel that motivates me to create more such videos in your future that's all for this video thank you so much for watching see you in the next one